Let's get right to it. This is hard for most in college to hear, and I understand. I have two college degrees, so I feel your pain. However, it doesn't change what is. In 99% of all information technology careers, your degree is irrelevant. The question then becomes, why don't colleges teach more applied skills? I don't know. What I learned in college was how to learn, not the skills I needed when I graduated. If you're a college graduate, you know how to learn. Knowing how to learn is important. Now that you know how to learn, the real learning can start. Let's list out some top-tier roles in information technology so you understand where I'm coming from. I was a SQL Server DBA for 20 years. There are no colleges teaching SQL Server. One or two database classes doesn't count for having any real-world knowledge. The other top database is Oracle. There are no colleges that teach you how to become an Oracle DBA. A few other database vendors are MySQL and PostgreSQL. Guess what? There are no colleges teaching you how to become a DBA in these products either. The three top cloud vendors are Microsoft, Amazon, and Google. There are no colleges that teach you how to become cloud engineers. How about data engineering? Nope. There are no colleges that teach you how to become a data engineer. Please listen carefully. The majority of those in information technology don't come from academia. When I say majority, 95% or more that work in information technology do not have degrees in information technology. You don't become technical in college, not how the real world works. Where do you learn to become technical then? You become technical after working with the technology for years. Well, how do you get a job in technology if you don't have basic skills you need for any role? You learn them on your own. When I first started my first role in IT, which was working on a help desk, I realized that the information I needed to know for any of the top positions was voluminous. If you want to become a top player in any IT role, you're going to need to become an autodidact. Continual learning and the application of what you learned is how you're going to succeed. If you aren't in an IT role and you want to become a data engineer, a machine learning engineer, you'll need to start off at a more entry-level role. Now, I'm not going to regurgitate the different paths. I've laid them out already, and I'll put a link to those videos down below. Today, it seems like many college graduates believe they'll be able to walk right into a top role right upon graduation. No, no you won't. I've hired entry-level machine learning engineers and data engineers at Uber and Microsoft. Entry-level meant three years of experience minimum. Now, I'm not trying to dissuade you or discourage you. A career in any of these roles I've talked about are fantastic decisions on your part. However, I want you to go into the space with your eyes wide open. If you don't, you're headed for a rough ride. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and have a great day.